Hi. Oh, hi, hey, sweetheart. How are you? I missed you. Can I my off to school, okay? Yeah, you saw my note. I, I picked them up from the quarter mates. Yes, thank you. I needed the extra sweet. I'm sure you did. You probably didn't get much last night. No, I'm sorry. I should have left you a note, too. It's okay. When I walked out of the bathroom and saw that you weren't in bed, I had a pretty good idea where you went. Yeah, I wanted to drop Jason's motorcycle off to him and tell him you could visit Danny whenever he wanted. Yeah, that's good. He, he, he probably should. Sure, Dad. I think we need to explain to Emma and Danny as soon as possible. Well, the crazy thing is, Emma asked Anna and me what would happen if Danny's father would ever come back, and we said it was impossible, and now it's actually happened. I just, I think we need to just make sure that Emma knows that you still love her. Of course I do. She's a strong, resilient girl. She's been through a lot, unfortunately, but she also knows that mistakes are made. The mistake was made with Jason, and now, now he's back. I know. I just, I'm not sure Danny is going to be able to understand all we'll this. Figure it out. Jake is. Sorry. Jason is, uh. is going to be in his life. He's going to be in our life now, so. I wasn't planning on putting this on his finger or anything. I just. It's been 24 hours, Sam. It's going to take some time to figure this out. I did see that you still have your engagement ring on, so to me, that says something. It says that you are the most amazing, patient, loving man in the whole world. Yes. Good morning. Hi. Hi. Come in. I'm, uh, I'm going to assume that you two have talked so you know about Jason. Yeah, yeah, I do. Okay, well, I'm sure that you have a lot to talk about, so I'll just, I'll leave you to it. i got to get to work. I, um, will pick up with you later, okay? Jason's, Jason's alive, and, and because of that, I'm, I'm thrilled and I'm grateful, but I dreamed of him coming back to me, not like this. Because he's not your Jason. I can't even imagine the emotional roller coaster you're having right now. Thank you. All right, I'm going to help in, in the way I know how. I, I'm going to try to take care of some practical matters, okay? Because there's legal issues. And then the first thing that we have to do is get a judge to overturn the, the uh, order of death. Wait, what, what, what does that mean? Does that mean that Jason and I are still married? You know, this is a very unique circumstance. We need to cover all of our bases. What does it mean? It means that you will have to divorce Jason. Is that what you want? <laughs> 